Are you tired of people adding you to group chats on your Instagram, especially if you don't know the other people in the group, especially if the person adding you is a spammer trying to steal your identity or your information or to sell you something or to steal your money or all of the awful things that they love to try to do on social media? There is a way to stop this and there's a way to slow this down as well. So go to your DMs and at the top of your DMs, you're going to see those three little dots. Click on the three little dots and you're going to click on tools. From there, you've got a lot of different options. We are going to go down to message control. So from message control, now we have even more options. You can see how you can deal with your requests and the followers and all those things. You're going to go down to group chats. And from group chats, you can say who can add you to these group chats. So you can either click on everyone, anybody can add you to a group chat, or only people that you follow on Instagram. By clicking this, the people that you follow will be able to add you, but if you're not following them, they can't add you. Now, does this work every single time? No, no, it does not. People will still sneak through. You might find yourself in places you don't wanna be in these group chats. Oftentimes they will go to your spam, uh, spam folders and the requests and all of those things. And if that's the case, you're just going to remove yourself from each of those um, and you can block that entity that tried to add you and you can report them if needed. But this should cut down significantly on the number of group chats that you are then added to. And then, of course, if you have somebody that you actually do know that you are mutuals with, that you're following all of those things and they add you and you don't want to be there, now is the time to decide how you want to handle that. You can leave the group. You can have a discussion with that person. You can let that person know that you do not want to be added to future groups without consulting you first. That's just a conversation you're going to have to have with them, but you can leave those groups. Now, please note, if you are leaving those groups, it does announce that you're leaving. It does let people know. So if you choose to leave a group, just be aware it's going to say this person's left the group after you've gone. People will see it. Most people won't care. Most people won't comment on it. But it is something that if you're doing this like with a tight group of friends, I know that not all of the people watching this particular video will be entrepreneurs. So if you are a person whose friend group has done this, just just be aware there are some ramifications and you might want to quietly have that conversation before you just like publicly storm out of a place. So be smart about how you have those conversations, but you can opt yourselves out of any of those group conversations that you want. And then you can change your settings so that only certain people can add you to those groups. Let me know what you think of this down below and follow along for more daily videos, helping you navigate the world of Instagram and TikTok and YouTube and live streaming and the tools and resources that you need to save time and effort creating your social content so you can build a more profitable business but spend less time doing it and a lot less stress. We'll see you in the upcoming episode.